a Diamond Dots art kit. It has a little sticky heart that you glue these beads onto, but it takes some pretty fine motor skills. It comes with various color beads, a dot sticking tool, and this wax square, and a tray. So let me show you how it works. Use the tray to hold whatever color beads you're gonna work on. And then this wax square is how you get sticky wax onto the tip of this tool. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. If it worked, it'll pick up a bead. Okay, it worked that time. And then we would stick it on this. And when you lift the tool away, the sticky film on the um, canvas is sticky enough that it pulls the bead away. So um, when you're getting wax onto here though, it may or may not stick to the beads. I'll show you what happens sometimes. Sometimes when you press down on those beads, they just won't stick. It's like the wax got wiped off when you were trying to wipe the wax on. It's a waxy glue, so we're gonna need to get some more. Um, we've tried sticking it, sticking the tool straight down in the wax. We've tried scraping it like this. Seems like scraping works better, but not reliably. Seems like the best way to get this glue to work on this tool is to scoop forward where it can get into the tiny hole in the end. Uh, it's, it's not very kid friendly if you're thinking that this is gonna be a simple craft. Um, it's, it's gonna take a lot of fine dexterity. So you can try like this and not get any glue. You can try like this and not get any glue. What you have to do is push into this glue wax pad until you get some clogging the tip of this tool. Now, placing it onto the canvas is simple. Um, as long as there's glue on the tip, you can place it right over, sometimes even get more than one to stick on there, and it, the project will go much quicker. But sometimes that glue just doesn't behave the way you would want it to. You can see it's clinging to the side here instead of it's even picking up another one that was already set in place. So uh, it can be a little frustrating to use this kit. When the tip is filled with glue, like you see here, it works very easily. Uh, you can go back and forth several times without having to stop and get more glue. And that's what we pictured, being able to just go over, press it down on a stripe. Where do we wanna put that one? Right there. Push it down and it'll stick. And then you don't have to get any more glue. You can come over and get another bead and bring it over makes the project go a lot faster, but it's still um, very tedious. I would say if you're buying this for a child, um, that would not be a good idea, first of all, for the little beads, but also because of the degree of dexterity that's required. But it is a challenge and kind of fun uh, once you get the hang of it. We've got a couple beads on here even. So where do we wanna put that now? Which place of the stripe? You can play two of them at once. Let's do two at once. Push it down on the sticker paper and there, we'll work twice as fast now. So I would think probably overall we would not get this again, but um, once you know the trick mm. of filling the tip with glue, you can actually accomplish the puzzle. <laughs>